Hello all, this is Holly and I'm here with my sweet little Matthew. Say hi. And Matthew wants to say hi to Mikey and to his other triplet brother who belongs to Yvonne from having you on. And he says Mwah! big hugs and kisses to both of his brothers. It got cold. Move it a little bit. It got cold here. Um, it's been cold all weekend. As a matter of fact, we've had a fire in the fireplace all weekend, which has been lovely. Uh, and it's still cold, and we are, um, I think, uh, I watched a video of Suzanne's today, and we were actually, um, a couple of degrees colder than they were at the time. Of course, it was later in the day for her when she made that. So I'm sure they're colder than we are now. But that was kind of strange. But it's been, uh, it's only been about a high of 40 today. And it was like 35 when I woke up. So it's been a little cold. So anyway, because it's been cold, we figure that this little boy, Matthew, is a little bit too summery looking in his little baseball uniform. So we're going to change him into something a little bit more warm and snuggly. So I'm going to put this uh, cream-colored knit uh, onesie, all-in-one, or play suit, whatever you want to call it, that has no feet in it. Uh, buttons up in the crotch. It has eyes, a nose, and a mouth on the front. And your guess is as good as mine as to what that's supposed to be. It's an animal of some sort. <laughs> and it uh, has little cuffs here and... Uh, these uh, little gray patches on the elbows um, to go with the little gray face on the front. So we're going to put that on him and I have a pair of little gray socks and then these little gray and uh, fluffy fur booties. So that's what we're going to put on him so he can be a little bit warmer. Although he doesn't look like he's complaining, does he? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Hello, big boy. So, thank you for all the comments that you said uh, sent on uh, his new body. He's very happy right now. He's very happy to have a new body. And um, I think he looks a lot better. And uh, so, we're excited about that. And now, um, I have ordered some hair. As he's got... Um, pretty color red hair. I don't know if it's showing up that much. Let me turn out this light. Does that help or now is it too dark? Yeah, that helps a little bit. So he has this um, pretty red hair. And I like his red hair. It goes good with his coloring. And I have a red-headed grandson, so that's nice. Um, but the, it's glued on. It's not rooted. It's just glued. And so, I wasn't real thrilled with that either. So, I'm going to try to reroute his hair. So, we'll see how that goes. But I did order him some more red hair. And uh, that's been shipped, so it's on its way. And we'll see what comes of it, won't we, Matthew? Yeah, I had some problems the other day of talking about him. I kept calling him Mikey. <laughs> and that's probably going to happen quite often because I'm so used to seeing Gail's um, Mikey uh, and he looks like a Mikey and that's his kid name is Michael the little slugger so um, yeah I'll probably slip up from time to time and calling that but we're gonna try really really hard to keep saying Matthew 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 aren't we he's such a happy little boy such a happy little boy. And he looks so much better on this body. Before, his arms were like way down here. They're like he had little gorilla arms. Little gorilla arms. He's just so cute. Mm, you are so cute. He is such a soft vinyl. I just am really enjoying this little guy. So, um, what have you guys been up to on this day? Let's take off your little socks, buddy. Let's take off your little socks. 
I've been busy today. I got uh, dinner on. We're going to have a roast, you know, the typical Yankee pot roast with uh, potatoes and onions and carrots and yum yums. So I got that on early because I'm doing that in the crock pot. And it's going to take about six hours. Should be getting close to being done. Let me see what time is it. Now it's 4.30. It'll be done in two hours. Yeah. So, yeah, we go. Or one and a half. One and a half. So I was going to change a little bit here. And um, I got... A haul to show you. I haven't even seen them. I, well, I saw one because it came right before Christmas, and I opened it, but I haven't used any of it yet. And uh, then I got another box today, so I thought I'd show you all that. And you know, these people have these sales; they're just so tempting, aren't they? Yeah, they are. And I have run out of so much. I have no room whatsoever so why i buy more clothes who knows uh, who knows huh there you go big boy now this is a, a zero to three months i haven't tried any other clothes on him but we'll see how this does he's about the size of where and william wears a large newborn or a small zero to three so that's what i'm thinking <clears throat> is going to be the case with my sweet little Matthew here. <laughs> he looked like such a big boy in his baseball uniform, and now he looks like a proper baby, don't you? Yeah, he sure does. He sure does. He looks like a proper baby now. But he's still a happy little thing. I don't know why any of these companies would put a uh, button-up crotch <laughs> on babies' outfits because uh, I can't imagine a, a live, wiggly little baby trying to button up this thing while they're laying there. That would just be a challenge. Challenge! There we go. There we go. Now then, you look warmer already. He does look warmer already. So yeah, I um, I wasn't really planning on doing a changing video today. I was just going to do the haul. But um, I came in here and I, I saw Matthew sitting there in that summery little uniform. I just couldn't stand it. He's like, I'm freezing and I know you have to be, so I had to change him. There we go. I don't know if the booty should go over or under the pants. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, so I hope wherever you are, you're staying warm. And those who are in the warmer climates, I hope you're staying cool. I'm going to put this one over and see what we get. So we got one over and one under. I kind of like it over. Let's do that. Let's pull it down. Let's pull it down. These are little booties are awesome because they open so far up and then they come across so you can tighten them down as much as you need. And then they belt on the side. So there you go. And can't really brush his hair, but it does have a little sticky uppy from his hat, so we'll just go over it like that. And there we have it. There we have it. There is my little Matthew in his <laughs> little knitted outfit. There you go. Say hi, everybody. And his pretty little cream colored some sort of animal outfit <laughs> and his gray booties there we are so i'm just going to move him over and get the boxes so hang on just a second 
Okay, so here is the first box. It is so dark in here, guys. But it doesn't, I know it doesn't look like on, it on the video, but it's so dark in this room right now. So I'm going to take these out. And I order from Wilbeth. And they sent uh, the catalog here, the classic collection of Wilbeth. I have quite a few of their clothes and I really like them. They're very well made and nice. And these are a little different than what I usually get. So here we have this box. And I got some little booties in several colors. These are pink and white. They have like a, a stripe, a pink and white stripe at the top. And the white booties and they have little pearls on the, uh, across the toe there that pull them up. And tie with a little pink ribbon i got them in pink i got some in blue and i got some in yellow yeah and then we got these outfits these are the ones i've looked at but i haven't taken them out yet i just thought some of these were just so sweet and they're so baby looking. That's what I like about them. So here we have this little, very light, um, like a linen cotton or very nice cotton uh, crossover top with a pink tie here. And it's embroidered with uh, butterflies and flowers. It has little puff sleeves and these little bloomers that go with it. It reminds me of the um, vintage type diaper shirts that we used to dress the babies in. Really nice pressed crisp cotton there. Very light. And that's a, I think that's a newborn. A lot, a lot of these in mind for um, Laurel and uh, Kaylee. They're not all newborn. Some of them are. And then this little dress, it's a size zero. And uh, it's got these pretty nice um, accordion pleated. Uh, it's a dress and the dress part is like these little accordion pleats. And it's got little pink accents and ribbon accents and little embroidered flowers on the top with the same um, puff little sleeves. It comes with the little shoes that have the same embroidered roses on, pink ribbon, and a little bonnet, a little ruffled bonnet with the same embroider on it. Isn't that cute? I just thought Laurel would look so cute in that. And then we have this, uh, another of that um, same type of uh, crisp cotton uh, for a boy and a I got this. I was hoping to get this for um, Ke Kelly, but um, they didn't have it in newborn. They sent it in zero to three months. I said that was okay. But it's a uh, blue and white gingham shorts, and it has blue and white gingham on the buttons, a white shirt, the blue and white gingham trim on the sleeves, and then it's embroidered with a uh, little sandcastle, a little soccer ball, and a bucket, a pail, and there's a shovel. Very cute little outfit. And I was so hoping to put that on Kelly, but it's going to be way too big for Kelly. And then... i got this little pink dress, and it's got embroidery on it. Looks like a... I'm not sure what that... I think that's like a little bird in a little birdhouse, and there's flowers around it. And there's a little bird uh, embroidered up here with a flower in his mouth. Cute little dress with a cap sleeves and a uh, little fl uh, flouncy ruffle around the bottom. And it comes together uh, up in the back and then the little ruffled pants underneath. And the last in this box is... Uh, a little white dress 
with scalloped edges that are trimmed in uh, pink embroidery and it's got a little ducks and flowers embroidered across the bottom and on the um, yoke and it's got another scalloped edge along the yoke and there's ducks and flowers on the top the collar comes around the back in a point and it has the little bloomers that go with it as well so that was all in that box and I uh, just got another box delivered today that I haven't opened yet so we get to see that together okay it's getting darker in here by the minute <laughs> So I'm just going to open this box here. Oh, um, if I got it right. Thank you for all the congratulations on our new grandbaby that's uh, going to be born later this year. We're not sure, probably sometime in September or October. I mean, she is just now pregnant, just pregnant. And just now starting to experience her morning sickness. <laughs> Poor baby. Poor baby. Okay. Yay! I got these little socks in. I thought they were smaller than that. But these are the little socks. And I have a pair of these that came with um, Layla when I got her. They're sweet little white socks. And the ones I have have pink ribbon on it. These are yellow. And I got a pair of blue. Those actually look a lot bigger than what I thought they would be. And pink. So just like the booties, I got socks in this one. Okay, now this was really cute, I thought. All of these things were on sale. That's why I got them, because they're all on sale. But this is a little navy blue dress. And it is size six months. Um, but it's different for a little girl. It's a little girl and it's got these pleats along the uh, navy blue uh, dress part. And then on the yoke, it's got a, well, it's got a Peter Pan collar that's a navy blue trimmed in red. And the little cap sleeves are trimmed in navy blue. And it's got an embroidered choo-choo train on the front it's got the engine and a little car with abc's on it and a little red uh bric-a-brac going around there buttons in the back and the reason i like this is because you don't see little girls with trains on it used to be like you know you couldn't you never did see little girls with um dinosaurs or sports motifs and things like that uh, and you don't see one usually with trains so i really like that the train and then we get this little white knitted outfit and it is uh, don't you know it's a romper it's a little knitted romper again it buttons in the crotch and it's trimmed in navy blue and it has a navy blue anchor on the left breast side oh it's a zero month okay so maybe kelly can wear this one and it has this cute little cap yeah i thought it was a tam at first but it's got a little bill on it um with the trimmed in navy blue with the navy blue button right there and then the socks they're white with navy blue trim and have the white tie on them. So, and it's a, a romper. And hopefully that'll fit Kelly. It looks like it'll be huge on Kelly. That's just like a very large zero month. And then I got another one that is knit, a white knit. And it also has a little hat, but it's trimmed in. Um, a sky blue or baby blue and it's a zero month and it has a little airplane uh, applique on the front and it's uh, oh it's a little shirt buttons down the back and then has the little pants isn't that cute now that looks like it would fit Kelly more than the other one would although they're both considered the same size go figure and then let's see this is something I could probably put... Oh, sorry, I bumped you. I 
I bumped you. And we have this one. Yeah, I think this is like a going home outfit, but it's got a detachable bib on it. See, it buttons at the shoulders, and it's got that nice crisp white um, pressed cotton. Uh, it says, Welcome Baby. It's got a little blue stork on it, and it's white, and it's trimmed in the baby blue. And the hat is a little stocking hat with a pom-pom on the top and another pair of those nice socks that tie with the uh, blue ribbon and it is um, buttons in the back and it has long footless trousers that go with it isn't that sweet that's so cute and of course that's got to be yeah that's a zero month and that looks like a nice little coming home outfit which i'm hoping would be the fit um kelly which the pants look extremely long so I'm not sure, and I thought this would be cute on Kaylee. It's the exact same outfit, but it's for the girl. It's, uh, the detachable bib it says, Welcome Baby, in the pink. And then it's got the little uh, hat with the pink pom-pom and the socks with the pink ribbon. And it's also got the separate pants to it. And pink buttons in the back instead of blue. So that is my haul. I have two boxes of them. And never could seem to get on to do the first one, so now we just did them all together. All right, well, thanks for stopping by. We'll put little Mike, yeah, and Mikey, look at me, I'm doing it again. Little Matthew up here. I don't know if he can sit on this boppy. Can you sit up on the boppy? Huh? Okay, I can sit up pretty good, but this boppy has a hole in it. Oh, sorry. All right, so there he is. Little Georgiana in the background. I'm not Georgiana. Listen to me. Oh my goodness, I'm calling everybody else's babies out today. That's Laurel. Hi to Georgiana. To Gracie. Mwah. Georgiana. Gracie. Mwah. And Sadie. So, yeah. Uh, maybe I'll call my babies by their names. <laughs> next time laurel and matthew thanks for stopping by thanks for watching the haul i uh, love you all stay safe stay healthy stay happy bye bye